great sacred treasure activate! Time has finally come, Pit. This is the final battle. Good luck. Thanks. I am so ready for this. Hope you didn't get too lonely without me. What are you doing here, Veridi? There's no way I'd miss the battle of battles. I make popcorn and everything. Hello again, Pit. Hades. Pit. Hades. Pit. Hades. Pit. Hades. Pit. Hades. Excuse you, but anyway, now is free! All to victory! Let me get a closer look at that shiny new toy of yours! Lord of the Underworld, it's time for you to pay! <laughs> you can be awfully cute, you can be. But that doesn't mean I won't squash you like a gnat! Whoa! Christ, my arm is stuck! Yes, yes, yes. Oh, better! Here you go! No, thank you! Great sacred treasure! Do your thing! Pity. I have something to show you! No, no, no! If you get caught up in that twister, it will tear you apart! <laughs> Corpses, but I didn't even get a pile started with him hot on my heels. What a kill joy. Your hunger for destruction is as boundless as it is callous, Hades. Plus, a mountain of corpses? Seriously? Are those face guns? Not just any face, Hades' face. I want you to remember every detail of this lovely visit. After all, it's the last face you'll ever see. No, no, pity. That was very naughty of you. Ow, 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 ow! The great sacred treasure is falling apart! No, it's it's changing shape again. Mech armor mode engaged! This thing is so awesome! You're starting to get on my nerves. Good! He's coming from head to toe with weaponry, like a rainbow apocalypse! I prefer to think of it as my devastation ensemble. I only wear it for very special occasions. You know, weddings, Armageddon. You thought 
thought you were. That's what you think. <laughs> Still stalking me, I see. That's better. What the? We've got incoming fire. Take out those blue shots. But those purple shots will hurt you, so don't shoot those. You can't get through this by shooting wildly. Focus on which shots to attack. This is this ever is so tiresome. So, so. Then let's finish it! Wait, wait. Huh? Ooh. Ah! Oh no! <laughs> Looks like your little toy isn't so great after all. Snap out of it, Pit! Pit! Wake up! Reviving, but I won't play the puppet anymore! No! How dare you! I am your master, Medusa, and I will revive you as many times as I desire! But you've worn out your usefulness! For Reedy. Don't thank me yet. Get your heads back in the game. Let's finish this once and for all. Okay, Pit, I've got a plan. It'll take some time to pull it off, so just tough it out for a little longer. I'm using my powers to charge up the gun of the great sacred treasure. Once it's fully charged, let loose. What a pest you are! I fight for all creatures living and breathing. I fight for all departed souls still hanging in limbo. But most of all, I fight for Lady Palatine, the goddess of life. And it's in all their names that I will crush you, Lord of the Underworld. I won't let you desecrate another soul! Now! The 
listen to those cheers! We did it! We saved every living thing! Everywhere! Not to rain on your parade, but now we're back to the real problem! What's that? Humans! You might live for this adoration, but I'm not fooled by those cheers at all. Sure, Palatina says that humans are closest to the gods, but she can be a real sap sometimes. Why do you care so much about them? Well, of all living beings, humans are the only ones with heart. Uh-uh, not true. All living creatures have an essence that can be described as heart. The humans have faith and devotion. That's what I mean by heart. Only humans believe in gods. Only humans respect the gods. Okay, A, you're not a god. And B, are you saying only believers deserve protection? Let him enjoy his moment in the sun. He saved everyone, not just humans. <gasps> then what's the point of faith and devotion anyway? Gathering up the gods to get greedy wishes granted? That's one way of looking at it, I guess. Huh? Pitu? I'm talking at you! Palutena! Haven't you learned anything? It's true. Humans are simple, selfish little creatures who are driven by greed. Sounds a lot like us gods, wouldn't you say? No way! <laughs> Nobody could be as selfish as the gods. <laughs> That's it. I'm done here. You guys can have your happy ending! It's our duty to protect them. Sorry I'm late. I had other business to attend to. It was my turn at last week. Oh, Let's not argue with Farrah. I'm so sick of you guys. You knock it off. Whatever you want to do, I'm sorry. You're not sure I'm sorry. That Great Reaper has quite the evil eye. How can you make puns at a time like this? The mirror of truth is just that. It reflects the truth. You've got me confused with the other guy. This pit is no pawn. I'll take care of him, but only after I finish you. Actually, I go by Thanatos now. The extra H is for amazing. A space kraken? Well, that came out of nowhere. Although, when prepared correctly, octopus is actually quite delicious. I'll strip you of your wings and sever you from the heavens forever. The Underworld Army has already reached the Phoenix. That's where my reset bombs come in. To help return Earth to its natural state! Pit, destroy the reset bomb pod to take down the entire depot. Not a problem! With all this firepower, Arlon must be preparing for a massive attack. Why on Earth would I be attacking? I'm far too busy defending, my dear. Persistent, aren't we? It's just one fight after another. Today is not my day. Let me drop a little knowledge on you. They're the Aura, and this castle of floating islands is just one of their bases. It looks like this will take you to the Aram Hive's power generator. Commencing Operation Hive infiltration. Pyron? Ha <laughs> ha I'm pulling the Aram strings now! You've become the enemy of all mankind. No one knows what happened. Did your goddess just lose her mind? If you want the lightning chariot, you must prove your worth. That won't be a problem. The goddess of light has turned dark. Everything is wrong, and it's up to me to make things right. The Chaos Kid is going to destroy the two. I'm begging you, Veridi. Let me fly, now! I liked her better when she was just an evil blob. She's still an evil blob underneath. She just has better hair, that's all. It's just me and that heart. Adorable little heart. Aw, oh, it's so cute. That's why I'm testing this young warrior. I need to know if he has the skills and heart to operate the great sacred treasure. Hades! Pits! Hades! Pits! Hades! Pits! It's on!
Well, I must say I am impressed. Such a teeny little angel defeating such a big bad god of the underworld. Why pity. That must make you the most powerful Nintendo character of all time. I'm actually rather proud of you. 8-Bit Pit would have never made it this far. But don't worry. I'm not going to tear up the credits again. The game really is over. Which is why I'm here to delete your save data. One, two, three, gone! No, I'm just messing with you, buddy. Settle down. Your saves are... they're... safe. I mean, I don't even have a body anymore. Couldn't delete a save file if I wanted to. I'm not even sure it can be resurrected in this state. There's the real tragedy. This dashing physique, this literally godly body, is gone forever. Ladies everywhere are no doubt weeping as we speak. Your fault. Oh well, I'll figure something out. I have, what, 25 years until the next sequel? Anywho, you can always revisit me and other friends in the chapters you meet. You could play our battles over and over again like a favorite book or a broken record. Oh, and if the mood strikes you, throw some hearts into the Fiend's Cauldron. Hearts spice up the difficulty on the level and can net you some sweet rewards. And because I'm not a sore loser, I've unlocked boss battle mode for you. So, here's to Kid Icarus Uprising, my new favorite game of all time. Thanks for playing. Hades out.